In this video, we are going to talk about the top key stocks which you can actually buy right now. And we'll also do a fundamental analysis of each of these stocks. Hello everyone, my name is Nikhil and in this particular channel, we talk mainly about investing as a beginner. We talk about education or career related topics and we talk about topics around productivity. So if you're someone who's new to this particular channel and you want to watch more of the future videos, feel free to subscribe. So without any further ado, let's get on with the video. Now these are the stocks that you should be actually keeping in your radar. Now this is not from an investment point of view but this is purely from a case study point of view. Now if you are an intraday trader who trades maybe in 2 minutes interval or half a day interval then this video might not add a lot of value to you purely because all the stocks which I mentioned in this particular video are purely from a long term investment point of view. Now the very first stock is Avenue Supermarket. Avenue Supermarket is popularly known as a D-Mart which is a chain of hypermarkets in India. In 2020 alone, they had an annual revenue of more than $3.5 billion. The stock price of Avenue Supermarket is currently trending at 3,360 rupees. And if you see the stock price over the last one year, it is actually trending near the 52 week high range itself. In terms of the market cap, the company has a market cap of 217,000 crores. Now if you do not know what market cap means, it is basically the value of all the shares of the company. So if you take all the shares of the company and you multiply it with the value of each share which is 3360, you will get the market cap of the company which is at 217,000 crores. Now when you check the return on equity, now if you do not know what return on equity is, it shows the performance of the company. So in case of the return on equity, we basically check what kind of profit has the company generated and we divide it by the equity of the company which is your assets minus your liabilities. So the best part of a return on equity is that we do not take into consideration the stock price. So it does not matter whether the stock price is going up or down. We actually take into consideration the company's performance. How well is the company performing? So in case of Avenue Supermarket, the return on equity for this is at 9.5%. And in case of shareholdings of the company, 75% of the shares are currently held by the promoters of the business. So your promoters are your owners or the board of directors. So the 75% of the business or 75% of the shares is actually held by the promoter of the company itself and this shows the stability of the business. So definitely because of these reasons, Avenue Supermarket is a great stock to keep it in your radar. Now the second stock or share which you should be looking into or keeping in your radar is the SBI card and payment services. Now SBI card is one of the leading payment solutions provider in India. Its parent company is the SBI Bank which is again one of the leading and the largest government banks in India. The stock price of SBI card is currently trending at 9.95 rupees per share. If you see over the last one year, the stock is currently trending near the 52 week high range itself. In terms of the market cap, the company has a market cap of 93,000 crores. So again, considering that it's more than 20,000 crores, it is a large cap company. In terms of return on equity, the company has a return on equity of 17%. If you compare that to the industry average, the industry average is only around 11%. And finally, if you look into the share holdings of the company, 69% of the shares are currently held by the promoters of the company itself. And this again shows the stability of the business. Now the third and the final stock which you should be keeping in your radar is Asian Paints. Now Asian Paints as we all know is one of the leading companies in its own sector. It is a company that deals into manufacturing and selling paints, home decors and other items. So in terms of stock price of Asian paints, it is currently trending at 3006 rupees. Over the last one year, the company has done really well and is currently trending near the 52 week high range itself. In terms of the market cap of the company, the company has a market cap of 287,000 crores. So again, this is considered to be a large cap company. In terms of return on equity, the company has given a return on equity of 27%. As compared to the industry peers, the industry average is at 13%. And finally, looking to the shareholdings of the company, 52% of the share is currently held by the promoters of the company itself. And this again shows the stability of the business. So definitely, Asian Paints is one of the top three companies which you should be having in your radar. Now, all the other stocks have given a strong quarterly result as well. Now, this is not from an investment point of view, but this is purely from a case study point of view. So that you are able to track and analyze these companies and keep them in your radar if you want to. Also, if you are someone who is looking forward to understanding how to trade in the stock market, 
or if you want to learn how to do intraday trading or swing trading i would highly recommend you watch this particular video this is going to be first video of the entire course of the stock market where i explain how to actually trade in the stock market so do check out this particular video and if you found this video useful do like it do subscribe and i'll see you all in the next video